welcome and congratulations the winners of the Relay Women. First position, Czech Republic. Second position, France. Third position, Belarus. Eva, can you tell us about the conditions on the course and the shooting range today? Uh, today the competition was very hard and from the morning I was very nervous because we didn't because I don't know what I can wait after Christmas but I think it it was <laughs> it was hard Gabriella we saw you in your competition struggling one time with a pool can you tell us a little bit about it uh, yeah, I had the same uh, feeling like Eva because I didn't know what can I expect after the Christmas. But uh, in the beginning of the race, I felt energy a lot. But in the last loop, I started to be so tired that I didn't know where is the finish. So I was really, really happy if uh, Itka was not so far. <laughs> and. I don't know what can I say more. Jitka, in Hochfilzen, we saw you on, on the podium, third position. Uh, actually, what was your guessing this morning where you could end up today? <coughs> and this morning, uh, when I woke up, I really didn't expect that uh, we can win this really. Because, uh, how said Gabriela, it is uh, the first race after Christmas. And I'm really satisfied and surprised. And I'm happy that I uh, manage uh, the shooting position because when I came to the shooting range, there was a foggy. Veronica, you looked very strong against Anais. Uh, were you confident that you could win after you left the shooting range? Uh, in last shooting range, it uh, was very hard because I was nervous. <laughs> And uh, I felt very good in the last loop, and I wanted to win. <laughs> Second became France, and uh, used face on the podium again with Marie Dorin. Um, how was it like to be out there competing for the lead today? <laughs> Yes, it's, it's nice to compete again, and uh, it was a long time uh, France uh, are not be in the podium, so uh, today it's, uh, it's very nice to be there and to be second. Have you been personally very surprised about your own form and to be Yes, confident? I don't expect anything uh, for my form because uh, it's just the second races I'm, I make um, this year, and I hope it will be better and better. And, I will see for the rest of the season. <laughs> so heading for the top spot. What? Heading for the top spot. I hope. <laughs> <laughs> Justine, how was your feeling with the special Oberhof atmosphere? Have you been stressed? Um, yeah. Um, I will. Um, uh, I was very stressed uh, this morning, and I. A bit impressed by uh, people and um, all the, the atmosphere, the spe special atmosphere in Oberhof, and um, I'm very happy today. But it's also motivation. Sorry. It's also motivation with the crowd. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, but um, just it's stressed. But um, I have to to be. To keep focused on my race and uh, and that's all. I'm really happy. Thank you, Nadeshta. You showed a great shooting. How have you felt in general today? Вы замечательно сегодня стреляли. Как вы себя чувствовали вообще сегодня? Ну сегодня был первый старт после длительного отдыха без стартов были только тренировки поэтому было немножко <coughs> волнение но вроде как я с ним справилась и в принципе и стрельба и скорость была довольно хорошая и я этому очень рада So 
but I have a good speed and I have shoot uh, shoot it also good, so I I feel myself also good today. There were some discussions about the tough course profile. What's your feedback? You have the comparison from the years before. Как ваше мнение о сложности сегодняшнего профиля дистанции по сравнению с прошлыми годами? Ну, в принципе, здесь самое сложное был этот спуск, но в этом году, по крайней мере, у меня для первого этапа спуск был хороший, без льда, хотя девочки говорили, что на четвертом этапе все-таки уже были сложности с ним. Поэтому, в принципе, трасса была хорошая по сравнению с прошлыми годами. I had only one problem at, uh, uh, with down, downhill on the Frankfurt Kreuz. Otherwise, was the track okay? And she had no problems with it. Nastasia, on the first legs, your team looked good, but then had problems with Pisa Reva penalty loop. Have you thought you could manage the podium at that stage? После штрафного круга Надежды Писарева у вас были надежды, что вы сможете добиться подиума в этой гонке? О чем вы думали? Дело в том, что я даже не видела, я пошла ну, одеваться, раз... заминаться, я не видела, что она стрельнула круг. Вот. Потом мы начали уже болеть за Дашу, ну, когда, гнать ее, когда были, поэтому мы не смогли ее встретить, потому что мы гнали ее на петле там, на дальней. So she said, I don't, uh, I didn't see it, and I didn't know that, uh, that she had a penalty loop. So, and we, we just supported Daria on the last loop. Do we have questions? No. Thank you very much.